Is this an artistic shot? Oh, just me. Um, so, sorry, I had to hold the camera with one hand. Let's see. Good morning, free birds. I am trying to make the bed, but I only got halfway because of this girl. Hi, Dina. This guy, Breaker, Kai, and Chanel. And Kai's tail. <laughs> you guys are making it so hard for me to make the bed. Yeah, I just have to do it like half at a time, huh? Like just, okay, so I get this half, yeah, and then I'll go over and try to do the other half. How's that? Does that work? Hey, don't you do anything on that. I Hey, I just barely, barely put that up there. Do not pee on it. I am watching you. Where are you going? I'm watching you. There you go. Wait, don't smell any. There, good. Lay down. Because every single time you get up and do something, you pee on it. And I have to figure out a way to stop it. I love you, Breaker. You gotta stop peeing on stuff. Today I have a lot of cleaning to do. I I never ever ever have liked to clean. I I hate to clean. I would love to hire other people to clean for me all the time. <sighs> yeah, all the time. If it was up to me, I would never clean up even after myself. I will be cleaning. I'm cleaning my house. I suck at it, so don't expect me to be like Martha Stewart cleaning. Oh wait, she cooks. I can't do that either. But this is cleaning my way, so just bear with me. I'm gonna get a few things done because I haven't felt like the best about myself lately and I think it's time to start doing some things you know that I don't like to do things that make me feel uncomfortable because the results are always what I don't want like I don't want to gain weight and become over overweight I don't want to be unhealthy and tired and depressed I don't want to be unfit so but I still don't want to go work out so you know that's an example like so then I don't go and work out um, and that's how it is with everything that's uncomfortable so I don't do the uncomfortable things and then you realize that if you do the uncomfortable things working out being an example uh, as a metaphor to my cleaning I guess I don't know anyway I'm just gonna clean today nothing great nothing fabulous nothing you know what if you don't want to watch me clean you can just stop watching right now because I wouldn't want to watch me clean cleaning sucks does that mean I have to work out too wait for the other ding if I should clean make the phone go beep hmm And then after I straighten up a little bit around here, I can also go and work out a little bit since I brought it up. I mean, I should start working out too. See, here's the thing. I don't want to go work out either. I hate working out. Uh, but I'm gaining weight. That is the reality of things. I am gaining weight and my house is covered in dust and I might not be in control of a lot of things in my life, but I should at least straighten my own side of the street, and my own side of the street is inside this house, and so I gotta start sweeping up and cleaning up. Have I mentioned how much I hate cleaning? <laughs> okay, well, I'm just gonna bitch about it a little bit more before I get started. Who could it be now? Remember that song, who could it be knocking at my door? Da, 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 don't let him in. Don't come around here no more. That song reminds me of my dad. Um, my dad will not watch these vlogs. He's not um, tech savvy, but anyway, that song reminds me of him. Isn't it nice when you have like a good memory about someone that you've had disagreements with for a long time? 
like, don't you love it when good things and good memories come up for no reason at all? Yeah, so, I'm just making excuses here to not get up and start cleaning. Okay, I'm gonna get up and clean right now. In here, it's a madhouse, I tell you. A mad, mad, mad house. Right, Kai? Isn't it, isn't it a madhouse? What? Are you gonna come over to me and say hello? Really? Oh, hello. Well, hi. How's your day going? It's fine. I'm going just fine, just fine. Give me food. Give me food. You got food? I want food. Oh, I give me some food. Oh, I got treat? Oh, no. You said the word. Uh-oh. What you got? Give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. What's up? What's up? <laughs> Yeah, I'm still not cleaning. Still not cleaning. Still not cleaning. This is me adulting. Clearly, I'm not the best at it. All right, I'll get up and clean right now again and stop getting distracted by my adorable, amazing dogs. First up, hydrate. Kroger. Nothing but the best for me. And the door just shut by itself because I think that the, uh, I think that there's also a ghost here. And no, I'm not just making up excuses so I don't have to clean in the closet. I really seriously think that there are ghosts in there. That's why I need some really expensive clothes in my closet so that I can um, conquer the, the ghosts with expensive clothes. And to me, that makes total sense. I could organize those towels. I mean, they are all clean and they're all in there. That's how I think, but maybe I should read that book again. The one by, um, oh, what was her name? What was that book? About, like, get rid of every single thing in your house that doesn't bring you joy. But after I take a shower, these towels bring me joy, even if they're not my favorite towels. So how do I decide? You know what, I probably should just not get rid of anything today. Today I'll just clean. <laughs> like, I'm just gonna be like, just gonna, I'm just gonna talk to you like as if you were my friend here hanging out. How's that? How's that for vlogging, huh? Sounds pretty nifty, right? See, I, I have like these old, old towels that I've washed over and over and over and over again for years and years and years and they become so soft and so perfect that I never want to get rid of them. And then even after they're the old, as, so old, then I cut them up into little pieces like this and then I use that. And I have, I have new towels, like new towels are, you know, who cares, like new great old better I just like old things because there's like a life and a story to them and no there's no story to this actual piece of crap hand towel <laughs> why am I saving it because it's cool it's cool it's old like urban uh, outfitters kind of old and I like that kind of stuff like these towels are, are new towels and I don't like them as much because they're new yeah I like new stuff but the best part about new stuff is getting to use it so that it gets to be old that's a good way to think about things huh hey okay. now look is that better and the big basket it's still full but they're all rolled up and so it looks cool. In my opinion, it looks cool. Oh, here, let me show you guys. This is a piece of art that I did. It's um, on wood, see? It's on wood and it's, there's paint on wood. See, there's my signature. I did it because I couldn't find the exact kind of 70s style that I wanted. Uh, to match with the kind of colors that I had, which is um, like this color scheme here. 
but more 70s-ish. So I painted this specifically for this room and it's also thick on the sides. See? So I like that piece. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming.